Happy Wednesday, everyone, and thanks for checking in on this first full day of spring here in the Northern Hemisphere. Today will be mostly dry, a little bit on the breezy side. We're going to have increasing fire concerns tomorrow, mainly uh, with some warming temperatures. So yesterday we were a little bit cooler. You can see some 50s and 60s up to the north, some 70s to near 80 along the coast. We had uh, almost 80 there in uh, Brownsville, but again, a little bit below average in many spots, with the exception of San Antonio and El Paso, at least a couple of degrees above average. Now, the winds were breezy. As you can see here, anywhere from 20 to 30 plus mile per hour winds. And that will uh, certainly be the case again as we start to see the winds uh, pick up a little bit more. So fire concerns uh, developing across the front range of the Rockies, more so tomorrow uh, with an elevated fire weather concern into our Thursday, basically from southeastern Colorado into New Mexico and then even into southern Arizona. So again, that's where the uh, winds are expected to be a little bit on the Augustier side. This is our winds tomorrow. You can see here from 20 to near 30 mile per hour winds developing. But uh, again, looking at the storm system unfolding over the northeast today, the tightly packed isobars allowing the winds to pick up a little bit more over the central and southern U.S. And then because of this ridging pattern taking place, we should stay dry underneath that. Most of our weather kind of being shifted up to the north. But as uh, we head into the end of the week, we are starting to watch the moisture kind of funnel over the uh, Four Corners region. But at this point, not looking at much precip through the end of the week.